All right, y'all, we're back, and we've been smoking the cigar. We've already gone down halfway, and it's it's a it's a great cigar, oh, yeah. right, Jubis? To it's say the least. Yeah. Um, what is it? It started off. Oh, damn, I don't know. How did it start off, dude? <laughs> we're already I, like I way past halfway. I found it pretty sweet from yeah. the beginning. It had that barnyard flavor that Doc coined the term, or uh, he just he was the first one that I heard use it. He patented his, patented. like, it's just, yeah. it's his word, yeah? It was good. It, that's how it started off. It's been like that. It hasn't changed. The burn's just freaking awesome. The ash just looks kick-ass. Tons of smoke. Tons of smoke. Tons of smoke. And, uh, and I'm we're, enjoying the hell out of that. Yeah, for sure, dude. It's got, you know, with the natural wrapper, you get, like, these, you got to experience, like, a lot of what are the, the filler tobacco flavors. You get, like, this rich tobacco flavor. But you also get like this kind of sweet taste as well, yeah, which yeah. is really cool, you know? Um, has it kicked up in strength? I mean, would you I say mild, say so. medium? I would say, would medium. say medium. It's, it's a solid, solid medium. medium. But it's got like medium flavor, right? Like, because it's got, it's got really good flavor, though, I, I would say that. Um, it's not so much in your face, but it's, it's there and it's really good. The construction's awesome. J Fuego. He's yeah. on his, he's on simply, he's a, him and Doc are like this. Yeah. They're like BFFs, you know. They're like, <laughs> they're yeah. like that, it seems like Jay Fuego's been on his show more times than we have, that's for sure. Yeah, huh, seriously. Yeah. Yeah. As well, he should, it's a they're damn homies. fine cigar. <laughs> so he's, he's making really good stuff. We have another Jay Fuego to go, so we can't wait for that. So far, we're doing this one, The Natural, and we're loving it. Uh, so what else is up on the chopping block? Still we chat news, that's what's up on the chopping block. That's right. So what's been going on on Stogie Chat? Bombings. Bombings. It seems that every week there's a bombing, and Marcelo seemed like every week he was bombing with Euro Pips. <laughs> Whether it be sausage, more sausage, <laughs> a kick-ass hat, or tequila. Or yeah. tequila. Yeah. And Marcelo's trippy, man, because that guy freaking... The, the bottle got there, it was broken... And then he freaking sent another bottle. I mean, that's 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 nuts, man. Yeah, he's he's, he's a madman. Yeah. So as you guys can tell, we were in the back. Now we're in the front, and that that's because all the kids started playing in the back. And I don't think I didn't think they were gonna you know let it be, you know they were gonna get in the way. And plus the smoke, I didn't want them you know breathing in the smoke or whatever. Uh, so now we're out here with all the cars and stuff, and it's pretty cool. Hey, check out the neighborhood. This is Oil Heights in in uh, in LA. Check it out. That's right. It's the yard. It's down the street. That's a car passing by. <laughs> yeah. If you're lucky, you might find a species native to our area. What's that species called? Oh, right. I'll let, I'll, I'll let you know, the expert chime in here for a moment. Right. Uh, yeah. Usually we have some sightings of this wonderful creature. That's not made so wonderful if you touch it. Man. Oh, you never oh touch you know, yeah! Don't don't touch them. I mean, they could be good for every now and then. Actually, if if you really need to, <laughs> they service really well. <laughs> what I'm talking about is the the native hoe or hood rat <laughs> or slat. Yeah, the native to this area. The very the. A peculiar cute creature that you know, just it's just so nice and like, you know, you can see them, you can notice them by their fashionable clothes, uh, but the, and, and their and their awesome cell phones, but they're pushing baby strollers, baby strollers. It's wonderful sights, and maybe we'll get the chance to see one today. If not, maybe tomorrow. You, you forgot the hair. Oh. Right. Another dead giveaway. You could notice them by their highlights in their hair. They believe that some strands are better than others. <laughs> so they show them off. So with any luck, we'll see one here today. Then that, you know. Yeah, yeah we'll you're, see. You're good? Yeah, I'm good. I, you <laughs> stopped me a long time ago, fool. <laughs> But it's a beautiful day here in Southern California, and we're, we're smoking great cigars. Uh, I, I'm sorry that, I don't know, are we getting a lot of people mad because we always say the same thing? It's a beautiful day. 
<laughs> we're having fun, you know? Well, people in Texas are all mad because Ike and, you know, the world's gone crazy and, and we're just a bunch of kids smoking cigars. I mean, that's... Yeah, I think we've got it pretty good. Yeah, we've got it really good, dude. We've got it really good. Uh, a couple more stuff. Jeeva's movie review? Yes, and I have, yeah. a, I have an extra review today. Really? It's a uh, movie that I saw this past Tuesday, and it's a fairly good movie. I don't know if you guys... It's called The uh, Run, Fat Boy Run. And it stars uh, the guy from Shaun of the Dead, Simon Pegg. You know, that really pale-looking English guy. And he's in there, and, main, and pretty much the, the whole per, the whole story is uh, the beginning of the movie. He's about to get married to the woman that he loves, you know, and but he ends up running out on her, on leaving her at the altar, because you know he's the type of person that always runs out on things, doesn't face up to challenges, you know. And so what you're saying is he's a man? <laughs> no, I'm just, I'm just, I'm just. <laughs> no, I'm, I'm, I'm joking. Well, he is a man. That's no, yeah, I was, well, I was anyway, kidding. Uh, I was kidding. So he does that, and then like, then you cut back to like a five year later scene, and uh, he's this mall security dude. And oh, and I forgot to mention that his, the his, his would be wife or whatever his she was engaged. He left her at the altar pregnant. So uh, five years there, the kid's born. He's still in the, he's in the child's life, and throughout five years, he's been trying to prove to her that he's trying to you know do better. And in the meantime. He's uh, trying to get back with her, but she finds someone else, uh, played by Hank Azaria, the guy who plays Mo Sislak's voice on The Simpsons. Oh, really? And uh, yeah. And basically, the that guy's like Mr. You know, perfect. He has a great job. He runs marathons for charity. <laughs> and, you know, and and, uh, and the Simon Pegg's character throughout the whole movie is, is trying to convince her that he's changed his ways, and with the help through his friend, which is also her cousin. He's trying to win her back by running a marathon against that other guy because he's running a marathon for charity, and each one has different sponsors. And Simon Pegg's sponsor was uh, Erectile Dysfunction <laughs> Awareness. <laughs> and uh, it's a funny movie. It's a great. It's a good comedy, right. and uh, get a chance to watch it. I don't want to spoil it. It's a good movie, and if you have a chance, find it. It's called Run, Fat Boy Run. <laughs> right on, dude. I like your movie reviews, dude. I, I hadn't even heard of that movie, but. That's something you definitely go check out. Um, I'm going to mention something else, please. I'm good. <laughs> All right. <laughs> Any Spanish terms? Boy. Uh, Boy. Boy, isn't that Brazilian? Isn't that, uh, what is it, Portuguese for hello? I, I thought it was today. <laughs> oh, yeah. <laughs> That's Spanish for today. <laughs> So yeah, y'all, uh, we'll be back with another episode of Churros y Puros. Another segment, right? No, no, no. No, no that's, that's an action. Yeah. <laughs> no, right now. We thought we saw a win. We were wrong. <laughs> no, I think that's an actual mother. <laughs> Not quite a hood rock, but I know we should do. Yeah, we'll be back. <laughs>